Yo, what is up guys? It is Roman and I will be showing you how to optimize your system for Fortnite and um this is really only for Fortnite. <laughs> you hear my keyboard scooting. It's, it's the rubber <laughs> things. But um this is really only for Fortnite. I I don't really play any other games besides Minecraft. Um but I mainly play Fortnite. That's what my channel and content's based off of. And this will be for Fortnite. So, and so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to, first of all, go to settings. All right. There's going to be, it, it's going to have system right here. And then power and battery, okay. Normally, as, like, as default, it'll have it on balanced, all right. You do not want that. You want it, you want it to have best performance. Th this boosted my FPS and it really does help. So we're going to exit out of this. And then from here, what you want to do is pre press Windows R. All right. And then it should pop up this application called Run, okay? I'll just put it in the center for you, for you guys. Run, all right. And then what you're going to want to do from here is type percent local app data percent, all right? And then we're going to... And you can press OK or press Enter. And then it will sh take you to this. So what you're going to want to do is press F. And then it should pop up Fortnite game. So you're going to double click this. Saved. Config. Windows client. And then game user settings. This is where it, this is where it looks scary, but it's really not. We're going to click on game user settings and then full screen this, okay? I know it looks super scary, but I, pro I promise you it's not. It's really simple. So, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to copy all of these. Well, not all of them don't really have to, but, um, what you really need to do is where it says B show grass. You need that to false. Okay. It will not impact. It will not impact the, uh, the color of the grass or texture or any really thing of the grass. It, it, it just boosts your FPS, and it gives Fortnite less things to render. I, I know I said it you, you can't see it. It's really weird. It's because it, it, that's literally just lowering your FPS. And then motion blur, B-show mo motion blur. You see how it's above it. That's really option, optional. Oh, little gosh. Can't talk. Uh, that's option, I, optional. Dude, <laughs> come on. That's, that's optional. Come on, gosh. Um, all right. So that's really your preference on motion blur. Uh, it's it's not required. You can turn it on or off. It doesn't really matter. So what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to scroll down until until you find resolution. Okay. All right. Right here. You see how it says, well, no, wait, is it right here? Oh, no, no, it's right here. All right, so, so whenever it says, wh where it says, be use V-Sync, turn that to false. That is absolute, that is horrible. It lowers your FPS so much, and it's, it's just bad. I swear, it's literally just bad. It doesn't do anything for you. So, wait. Oh, dang it, I lost resolution oh all right here it is here it is uh so where it says resolution size x you're gonna want to put that to 1024 whenever after we've done uh, after we're done applying this i i promise it will look a little weird it will look scary i promise but it's super simple all you all you have to do is just press is just um type in 1024 and then 768 and then do that for um last confirmed user size x and then and then to do it for any word that says uh in like x y you see that and then screen width 1024 by 768 and then uh oh well no well desired screen width 1024 by 768 and then uh anything that says like 1920 by 1080 or whatever that's the default and you need to change that to uh, 1024 by 768 and we're gonna want to x out of this x out of this and then we're gonna type windows r again 
and this will open the run application you're going to want to type percent temp and then percent again enter and then it will bring up to your temporary files these are my file viewer files so these don't delete because i do uh it's called cool file viewer it's just it was a um file viewer that came with my computer but you, so what you're going to want to do these are temporary files so they they're temporary so they're so they're just slowing your computer down what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to drag through all of them left click and then where it says delete uh well, well not two files you're going to want to drag through all of them and then where it says up here you're going to want to click delete it's obviously not going to um delete because i this is my uh video capture and my cool vi and my cool file viewer and that's actually what it's called i know it's dumb but um and the, it won't delete because those are essential fire files for applications and then it uh essential files for applications in this temporary files those will not delete they will automatically stay there um and, and then if you get that same notification that i did or whatever you can just x out of it don't stress it you're, you're fine and that's pretty much it um there will be an fps pack in the description that um i will i will have in the second part of this video so you need to stay tuned for that and i will let's hop right on into that Oh, dang, can't stop it. Come on. Yo, guys. So, uh, I am in the second part of the video, and the FPS pack will be in this, in the, in the, oh, gosh, the description. And this is what the FPS pack is, alright? So, it is, it is just a really optimization. And see, there's ping tweaks, and there's additional optimization. And then you need to really apply all of these, but there will be a um, pass, and it's just and it's Mega Legend plays, but with a Z, and then and then that's what it is. And this will be in the description. It's really it's a really good FPS pack. Um, as you can see, driver optimizations, and and it's just uh, it will optimize your PC very good, and that um. That is it for this part. Let's go on into Fortnite and see how it performs. Mm -hmm. Yo, guys, I am in a creative. And as you can see, I have my FPS cap at 160 and it is staying there. And I, uh, I have a 3050, 8 gigs of RAM and an Intel i5, 12th gen, I think. Yeah. So it's pretty impressive i'll i'm gonna turn it on unlimited oh yeah you guys also need to copy these in game settings just for the maximum not not the resolution part that's already good if you have stretched resolution but windows window mode you need to put that in full screen just and that will just um and that'll just optimize your game over anything else that's burning in the background and uh but but your brightness and color brine mode that's all optional uh, me personally, I like to put it on Tryon and Nope. I think that's how you say it. And then, um, brightness. It will try and cope the strength on, on 10. And then my, uh, brightness on 150. So it's actually, so it's pretty good. It looks really good. And as you can see, I and I'm recording right now, which will Im impact my FPS. But I'm getting 200. Well, I think I capped my FPS at 240. Yeah. So as you can see, I'm getting around 300 FPS with this. Looking down, but building. I'm not looking at that right now. I'm just trying to edit really good. But this, it, it really did boost it. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. 
uh, I am a small content creator and trying to get big. So if you did, guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to like and subscribe. It, it, it really does help, help, help out more than you think. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was how to boost FPS in Fortnite Chapter 4. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya.